What up, y'all? It's your man C. McCarver Jr. Just giving my input in real quick about all these quarterback, uh, all this quarterback talk everybody doing, you know, Deshaun Watson, Aaron Rodgers, yeah, you yeah, know. Here's my opinion, and this is my opinion. First and foremost, I am not giving up on Jimmy Garoppolo, okay? I'm not. I'm not. Um... But I, I, I do, here's the funny thing. If Deshaun Watson, for example, he come over here, learn the offense, I wouldn't be mad at that. Aaron Rodgers, he come over here, don't really have to learn it too much because Matt LaFleur's offense, you know, is basically Daisy Chain from Kyle Shanahan. Y'all know how they do. I wouldn't be mad at that either. Is it possible? Heh. <laughs> That's the thing, man. It's not that it, it's not just that easy. Like they just make it happen. I mean, first of all, y'all know Jimmy Garoppolo has a no trade clause in his contract. And number two, I mean, they talked about like these three way uh trades with uh Patriots and back and forth and all that. Man, there's a lot to factor in, y'all, before they just the Niners wouldn't make a decision like that. I mean, you got the, the, the chemistry, like George Kittle will sit up here and say that there's chemistry in that locker room with Jimmy Garoppolo and just how everybody gravitates to him and everything, man. John Lynch, I'm sure John Lynch and Kyle Shanahan look at all of that, you know, maybe in the back of their head, they consider another options, but come on, y'all. I mean, the, the idea is I know that some of y'all are just, just had it with Jimmy Garoppolo. I know. I mean, he had some great games and he had some bad games. Even, you know, and, and here's the thing, too. Going back to the year two seasons ago when he was healthy the whole time, you know, some of those games, the defense won, basically, you know, and Jimmy contribute to it. I mean, we can go on about the Super Bowl and that, that, that ball he missed, uh, um, Sanders, you know, but go back to the freaking Saints game and how Jimmy played in that. You know, so he has his ons and offs. I think I think Jimmy can contribute just enough. But with, you know, complimenting with our defense uh, to be like it was before, that's good enough. And you have to consider everything that you have to do um, if you want these other quarterbacks. And it's just, you know, we know we got to pay some people. We got to, man, we got to pay for Ed Warner. We got to pay some people. And um, I, with everything that we would have to sacrifice, give up, trade, um, I'm fine with keeping Jimmy. But if they want to bring somebody in, uh, like I said before, he has to come in here. And he got he got to do way better. Y'all would say y'all would say, oh, this guy would do way better. Whoever can come in and bring us there, that's fine. Do I think Jimmy can do it? Yeah, I think Jimmy could do it for sure. But if they try to improve this team, you know, I think that's the overall thought process in the off season anyway with every team. But is it possible? I mean, look at everything. What has to be done? Even Deshaun Watson has a no trade clause, but I think I think Houston Texans will eventually find a way to make him happy about leaving because he don't want to play there. It's funny, Aaron Rodgers said he he ain't too sure about Green Bay either. But is there somewhere he wants to go? Do he want he probably wanna come over here. Y'all know Aaron Rodgers grew up a Niner fan. And he get to fulfill his dream. And I know he wouldn't mind coming over here. But is it possible? That's all I'm saying. So I know the idea sounds nice, y'all. But for now, Jimmy is our quarterback. And until otherwise, you know, it is what it is. So I, I look at all this stuff and what people are saying. And even on ESPN considering these other guys but it's like is it really possible you know is it really the smart decision considering all you have to move around and it's just too much it's just too much y'all 
So until something happened, you know, it's Jimmy G all day. And that's my opinion, y'all. But we all have ours, you know. It's just an opinion, y'all. So, but anyway, it's your man C. McCarver Jr. Catch y'all in traffic, man. Peace.